Hello, Danny Blythe, gallbladder syndromes, um, and a little look at the gallbladder because this is quite a short one. For acupuncturists and Chinese medicine students, please pause and read this. Gallbladder is responsible for what is just an exact determination and decision stem for it. This is the um, excellent translation of Su N8 from Father La and Elizabeth um, Roche de la Vallier, which I think are the best translations. Let's just have a look under the bonnet of this a bit. If we have a look under the bonnet of this a bit, the gallbladder, regarding the gallbladder, it's responsible for what is just an exact. So this character is like central, but when something is just in the right place, just exactly the right amount of something. Um, and this character shows a foot and towing the line. So when something is just so and towing the line, and this isn't of, and this is the official. So it's the official of being just so and towing the line. So these are the characters for decision making. So this character has water on the left and a hand and a foot on the right. This was originally the character for um, clearing a blockage in a waterway um, to resolve a blockage. And from that, um, clearing a problem by making a decision. And this character shows silk that's been chopped in two. Um, so to cut into two or to decide like um, definitive decision making and later on on the right hand side an axe was added so it's sort of re um, resolving by making a decision and being decisive omit from it and the functions that we learn it stores and excretes bile which aids digestion it rules decision making as we said above and it activates the tendons, helps the liver in its role. So the thing about the gallbladder is it always acts as a bit of a hinge. If we look at the gallbladder channel, it kind of looks like a hinge along the side of the body, sort of half uh, halfway channel, one of the longest channels on the body. It's also a hinge in that it's um, both an ordinary organ that has to do with digestion, so it's the pair of the liver and it deals with digestion of fats and bile, but it's also an extraordinary organ in that it stores a yin essence, so it stores bile. Um, so it's not directly related to digestion like the other foo and to the dirty waste, it actually has a refined um, essence. So we see that with points like um, gallbladder 25, the front move of the kidneys, um, gallbladder uh, 39, which is the way point of marrow, and gallbladder 18, which is the receiving ling point. We also see this in its relationship with the triple burner, which has to do with the yuan qi. And we could say that it's an expression in some ways of the hun as the yang aspect of the um, liver. Ling Shu too says that it's the central, this just so character again, essence, this is Jing. So it's the fu, the yang organ of central essences. So it's hinged between being an extraordinary and an ordinary organ we see in the gallbladder deficiency, which is unlike any of the other Yang organ syndromes. And we have to remember that um, in Ling Shu 8, um, they talk about uh, the liver qi. When it's deficient, we have fear. And when it's excess, we have anger. This pattern is the one of the gallbladder as its role in digestion as an ordinary foo. And we talk about damp heat, but we can have um, just heat and we can have just damp, so we're gonna separate them out. So if we have damp, then we get symptoms like inability to digest fats, nausea and vomiting, yellow complexion, yellow eyes, turbid urine, heavy body, loose stools, no thirst, slippery pulse, and thick sticky tongue coat, so damp 
um, obstructing. We also get damp obstructing the um, liver and gallbladder channel. So we get symptoms along the channel, hypochondriac pain, fullness or distension, a dull headache, irritability, wiry pulse, the tongue coat um, is either unilateral like so or bilateral in strips. And we can see um, why we get hypochondriac pains and headaches here. Heat, we get a bitter taste, remember the key symptoms are underlined, scanty dark, yellow urine, feeling of heat, constipation, yellow sclera eyes, thirst, pulse is rapid, tongue coat is thick and yellow. Um, if it's the channel, you can also get headache, eye pain, dizziness, tinnitus, dry throat. That's um, You can see from the channel where that is. We also, we need to work out how much damp and heat if there's both. So heat gives us thirst, the damp gives us no desire to drink. Um, heat will give us constipation, damp will give us diarrhea. Heat will give us dark urine, damp will give us cloudy urine. And if the damp heat cooks up over a long time, we can get a damp heat diamond or a gallstone. Etiology, this can be caused by long-term anger and frustration, a poor diet, which is too much damp forming foods or too much heating foods, or it can be an external pathogenic factor. The treatment principles match the three aspects to it, damp, heat, and liver and gallbladder channel obstruction. Now we have the gallbladder as an extraordinary um, organ, and we see gallbladder deficient um, so remember uh, when the liver chi was deficient we have fear and when it's in excess we have anger. So this is the gallbladder's role in decision making. So we get um, indecision, lack of initiative, lack of anger and lack of assertion. Remember that um, anger that's appropriately expressed is assertion. Um, lack of courage. Nervousness, timidity, sighing, um, mild chi stagnation, being easily startled, uh, waking up early in the morning, especially with palpitations and feeling panicky, and restless dreams. Because the wood element is deficient, we also see signs of liver blood deficiency, so we get things like dizziness, blurred vision, floaters. So this looks like a liver yang or chi deficiency um, or a deficiency of the hun in terms of the dreaming, the lack of direction. This can be the character of a person, can be constitutional or it can be caused by trauma, especially trauma in childhood. And we tonify and warm the gallbladder and tonify the liver chi, a very famous formula called when Dan Tang warm the gallbladder, the decoction is used for this. Oh well done, you made it all the way to the end.